You again mentioned this thing about the foundling from the shires. Let me speak up for my little princess, Queen Alexandra. Now, she really came from outside. But there was one thing she understood, and her husband was a good deal more unfaithful than Prince Charles. And that is that the rent we pay for staying at the best address in London is discretion. It's not going on panorama. But in answer to B's criticism of the, of the way in which this young, innocent woman mm. was, was brought into a marriage which was a, a false marriage, I mean, in, the, in that it was an old-fashioned marriage, which was that you know, she was the virgin bride and her husband could be, there betray were, her, but that somehow that was acceptable. There were other candidates who had declined the kind of life that it entailed. So part of the compact, she entered into a compact in which she should I have known. I would have said that in the second half of the 20th century... She knew. She knew much more than Princess Alexandra would have mm -hmm. known at the turn of the century the kind of discretion that was inherent in accepting... The only time so will she, tell. she was a girl by then sharing a flat with other girls. I mean, she was a modern young woman. Um, Sorry, that class is not modern. That's the point. That was what was revealed. She was not like the other girls of other classes of her generation, who may be sus. Oh. And for sure, more important than that, in a sense, her husband was not like his generation. He could have done something different.